Hello everybody and welcome to Let's Look at NFL Blitz. This is a uh, well, new release on the Xbox Live Arcade, but obviously a revival of the old series, the NFL Blitz series, that was from Midway, like, I guess over 10 years ago now. I mean, I was playing a lot of Blitz 2000 this weekend, but that's 2012 now, so I guess this is, uh, yeah, more than a decade overdue. Now, this was just released Xbox Live Arcade and PS3, and I'm just going to play now and basically see how faithful this is to the original. Now, of course, there have been some Blitz games that have come out, you know, over the past, I guess, like, five or six years, like Blitz the League, and I think there was a Blitz the League 2, but they didn't have the actual NFL license. This is the first one that has come out, I think, since Blitz 2000, or maybe Blitz 2001, actually. They actually had the NFL license. Now, NFL Blitz is obviously not a sim. I believe it's 9-on-9 nine nine or 7-on-7. Seven seven. Let me just pick a team here before I get too distracted. I'll go as the Packers. And we'll play against the Saints. I mean, obviously some of the teams are locked here in this uh, setup right here, but that's okay. And, oh, one second. It actually is the code screen, so you can re-enter codes. All right, this is straight out of the, like, arcade and N64 original PS1 as well, where you can basically just enter codes by mashing the buttons as fast as you can and try to get something useful. I didn't get anything useful, though. And this cheerleader screen with the tips is actually right out of the original as well. So Blitz kind of lost its way, I would say. Uh, it was originally just, like, a fast-paced arcade hard-hitting football game, and you could like hit people after the play, you could give them stone-cold stunners right on the field. Uh, and then it became kind of like a gritty, like, watch this guy's nutsack of erupt on camera type of game when Blitz the League came out, and I was kind of not so much into that, but this is certainly a revival of that old style, and I'm having kind of like, I was going to say non-flashbacks, but like Blitz flashbacks from when I was a kid. Let's just take a look at this for a second. So it's very, very simple. There's only a set number of moves that you can do on offense when you have the ball. So we've got Turbo Spin, which is just Turbo Turbo, and then Stiff Arm, which is Turbo and X. Oh, that was pretty poor. Now, Blitz, again, I'm going to mention here, is not a sim. So every play, or every first down, requires you to get 30 yards. And there are no rushing plays, minus, you know, sometimes getting a quarterback sneak. So I'm going to be playing as the, uh, the Green Bay Packers here, the white, yellow, and green team, in case you're not familiar with American football, and honestly, I haven't followed American football in a long time. Oh, that was such a bad pass! And the other thing is, there's no penalties, so you can just do defensive pass interference. So if you know that the ball is coming towards somebody, uh, just tackle them as fast as you can, basically. That's the best defense. And the best offense, as far as I'm concerned, is just hike the ball, drop back as far as you can, jump in the air, and then try to whip it like 80 yards downfield. Blitz! No one would ever accuse it of being a deep game, but it is an awfully fun game, especially if you have a chance to play with friends. I mean, I'm, I've only played like two minutes here, but I'm already having a pretty darn good time. It's clear that this is a pretty faithful recreation. Oh, we got it! First down. Look at that, that was like an 80-yard pass. Pretty faithful recreation of the uh, of the Blitz formula, let's put it that way. Let's check out some of our players here. You can see, I wasn't lying to you, all... Uh, all... oh, one second. QE post where? Ah, oh, I didn't get it. All running plays. The only thing I don't like is that they've actually changed the pass button. That's how much blitz I played literally this weekend. I went to that, uh, I was on vacation. I went with a couple of friends and we just hung out in a hotel for a while. And while we were, n while we were in the hotel, pretty much all we did was play blitz, which I know sounds crazy. Is this Aaron Rodgers? Oh man, that's horrible. Uh, Blitz 2000, I should say. Let's not get confused between Blitz and Blitz 2000. Anyway, what is this, third down? Also, never go for a field goal or a punt. That is so against the Blitz ethos. So now we can do like a bunch of just play act or uh, option plays. Oh, that was horrible. I'm going to break my own... No, I'm not going to break my own rule. I'm going to go for the touchdown. I wonder how many quarters they'll give me here. Yeah, fake field goal is always the greatest. Oh, man, that meter is going so fast. Thank God I went for a fake. Oh, there he is! He's open! Touchdown! I don't even know who this is. I don't know any of the players in the NFL now. I haven't followed in like 10 years. Nice touchdown celebration. The one thing I don't like about this game, but I, I knew it was coming, I, I read about it online, is that they got rid of uh, late hits. So it used to be like after the play, you could literally just jump on a guy's face and murder him, essentially. And in this one, I think the NFL was like, ah, we would, we'd rather you that you didn't murder Tim Tebow. I think that maybe sends the wrong message to little kids who might be playing this game. So instead, you just kind of walk around like you do in the real NFL. What is this computer doing? Short passes? It's NFL Blitz, not NFL Shits. Uh, and actually, defense is almost as much fun as offense, simply because of the fact that you can just murder everyone. 
Uh, sorry, not murder, of course. Gotta think of the children. Uh, but, like, one of the best strategies on defense is just look and see which receiver is open and then just tackle him. Or, better yet, just tackle him right at the line of scrimmage, like I'm gonna do right here. Okay, yeah, I got him. What are you gonna do now? Well, I guess you're gonna not get a first down. I thought that was complete, actually. And I'm not sure if the computer will punt. Let's go for block. Looks yeah, like it looks like they're gonna punt, so. Let's just wait back here. Maybe I can return this one. Where is it? Where's the... I couldn't even see that thing on the screen. I can't believe it's only the first quarter. Oh, that was a good spin. My guy gets really, gets really slow, though. The one thing about Blitz that's kind of funny is that the defense is so much faster than the offense because the offense basically just holds turbo the whole time. So in the normal NFL, like, someone will break open a play and then they'll just run, like, 70 yards. That's not that unusual. It's a good catch. But in, uh, in NFL Blitz, like, if you get ahead of the defense, you're going to run out of turbo and the defense is just going to tackle you down and end your life. Oh, there's nothing, uh, there used to be loading screens in the old games where they would show you a tip and they'd also show you, you know, like a scantily clad cheerleader after each quarter. This is a perfect opportunity for a QB sneak. Gotta watch out for fumbles, though. Those happen all the time. Let's go with, uh, let's go for spider legs. That's eight of them. That's, that's like everybody I have on the field. Oh, God! <laughs> Aaron Rodgers, what are you doing? Costing me the game here. Uh... You know, I don't know why I'm mixing it up. Always go da bomb or Hail Mary. Works every time. Option plays are, of course, valuable as well. Look at this guy. What does this guy think he's going to do? I guess he's going to tackle me. Fourth down again. Seems like a good time for a fake field goal. I mean, by now, if you're watching this and you're a football fan or you're familiar with the rules of football, you know if this game is for you. Oh, that's such a touchdown. You know if this game is for you or not for you. And I mean... <laughs> If you're a fan of like NBA Jam, games like Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey, or you played the original NFL Blitz, that's probably the most popular out of all of them, except for maybe NBA Jam. One second, I'm going to try to do an onside kick. Didn't work. Um, then, oh, how did that not tackle him? Uh, then you're, you're going to be a fan of this game. This is $15 on Xbox Live Arcade, which is not that steep for what you're getting here. What I will say is that you're really, really going to want to play online in this game. I have not done online play with this game, but the multiplayer is what made NFL Blitz so good. Yeah, it's up to four-person multiplayer. So you can play with a friend against two strangers, or you can play, like, um, four-person online multiplayer, I should say. Or you can play, uh, you know, just against one stranger online. I'm not sure about the other setups that you could possibly do, but obviously those ones exist. Game is so much fun if you can just find a partner and you know, like, he's a great quarterback and you're great at getting open and not getting destroyed to the line of scrimmage. Oh, that's a fumble. I'm out of turbo, though. I can't go anywhere. Whatever. It was like a minus four yard return after the fumble. I can take it. 14 nil already, right? I've been practicing. Oh, that's another great opportunity for a QB sneak. Just get out of bounds, you're going to fumble it. Aaron Rodgers, one of the most sneakiness QBs in the league. He's played the bomb over and over. And like, you're probably realizing by this point, oh, that was bad, that there's a very limited amount of depth when it comes to blitz. I mean, I'm not sure if you guys know who Jeff Gersman is. He's basically, he used to work for Games, uh, GameSpot, and now he works for, where's my Hail Mary? There it is. Now he works for Giant Bomb. Apparently he played in like a professional Blitz tournament, or as close to professional Blitz as you can get. And uh, he pretty much echoed the same thing. He was like, the only thing you do, onside kick, the same defense, prevent defense. I think it's called safe cover in this. Uh, and Hail Mary's into Bomb. This is the only plays you need in the entire game. But what's so fun about it is just that it's so over the top constantly. That's another touchdown. Computer, what are you doing? <laughs> I'll just backflip corkscrew Bucky Lassick into the end zone there. 21 mil. I like how the kicks are automatic too. They're like, don't waste your time with this. Uh, I'm going to see if I can check out the controls here. And maybe do an onside kick. How to play? I, uh, let's check out controls. Um... Offense, that's not going to give me enough. I'm going to have to go to how to play. Table of content? Yeah, I guess let's go to the table of contents. This is the actual game manual in the game. I don't care about blitz bucks. Onside kicks, onside kicks, onside kicks. Well, you can read about the game modes there if you're going to, you know, pause the video and read really quickly. I'm not sure how to do onside kicks. In the N64 version, it was hold up and then like ZR 
or Z A B. So I'm just gonna hold up in all the buttons. Yeah, didn't work. All right. It's a shame because I could be up by like 60 right now. Because onside kicks have like a 30% success rate, which is actually really good considering, you know, normally if you're playing against, oh, you never should have taken suicide blitz. They're gonna get a touchdown here. Suicide blitz is a suicide play, unless you tackle all the receivers at the line of scrimmage. Except for that one. Thank you, computer. Did me a solid there. The quarter's almost over though. And now, if you're a real football aficionado, you're probably looking at this and saying, uh, "Why isn't the clock?" Counting down, and the reason for that is that NFL Blitz doesn't give a shit. It's like the honey badger of football games. Oh, that was kind of beautiful, actually. But I love uh, defensive pass good. interference. Has no consequences. Yeah, so the clock stops after every single play in this game. Let's go zone blitz. There's no way they're going for a field goal from here. Just tackle them right. Rated. Oh. Well, third and twelve. Now they'll probably go for a field goal. I'll try to block this. Blocked field goals, I feel like in Madden, never worked, but uh, in Blitz, they work fairly frequently, especially when they only have three people on their offensive line. Is that good? That went in? Alright, that was the end of the second, 21-3. Also, the game's been pretty good so far about the length of the trial, unless this is it right here. Um, not right now, I choose not to unlock the game. Maybe this will show me about uh, onside kicks. It's gonna show me what love is anyway. Ooh la la. Oh no, it's only two quarters. Well, that makes sense, you know, because uh, NFL Blitz is actually two minute quarters, and they gave us two two minute quarters, which is pretty good for the full uh, for the trial. Uh, I'm absolutely gonna pick this game up, but whether you should pick this game up depends entirely on whether or not you're a Blitz aficionado or a Blitz fan, or this looks interesting. If it looks interesting, like, what you see is what you get. You're not going to get NFL Blitz and be like, oh my god, the gameplay is so radically different. Northern Lion didn't show me, like, everything changes in the third and fourth quarter. That's, that's not going to happen. What you saw, just nonstop Hail Marys, sacks, interceptions, fumbles, defensive pass interference, <laughs> offensive pass interference, encroachment, all that stuff is the game. That's it. It's not deep, but it is a whole lot of fun. So, you know, I would recommend NFL Blitz for anyone who's a fan of those arcade sports games that we don't really see that much of anymore. Wayne Gretzky's 3D Hockey, NHL Hits, NBA Street, stuff like that. This is absolutely in those vein. And in fact, it was one of the progenitors of these games as well. So, as always, this has been Northern Lion. Thank you guys for watching.